feel like Diamond Kinetics is helping me and other players because a lot of players in the recruiting process get overlooked. I think the exit velocity and the bat speed correlate a lot. A uh, scout can look at a kid's numbers and see, you know, he had a 95 exit velocity and give the kid a look. I go to a Florida baseball ranch and they use a lot of technology like that, but the putting the thing in the knob, reading your like max barrel speed and all that, that was, that was pretty cool. Hey, when you're working for that, the goal, that contact, that pure contact and that high exit velocity, the instant feedback is what drives you, you know? The stats come in right after you swing, so really beneficial. Like right there, from the left side, and you hit that ball, and it starts to do this right off the bat. So instead of having a positive angle going to contact, you have a negative angle when you get here out front. And so what that does is that, that not only does it cheat your exit velocity because you've already rolled over, but you've also changed the angle of the impact on the yeah, ball. And you can only pull. Yeah, you can only pull and, and you're going to impact it with top spin instead of being able to generate and drive through. Of course, yeah. You're just getting to this position as opposed to this position. Yeah, I love it. Like, it, it gives you like an inside look on your swing and everything. The measurements that you get aren't like at average level, you, you know you gotta work more and work out more to get, um, to increase those numbers. It helps me that there's technology involved because it, it gives you like, the, like a precise number so it shows you that you're, you're doing this wrong instead of somebody directly telling you by the mouth. You feel me? Like you see numbers. You were one inch further back, so what happens? So instead of being there at contact, I'm right there. That's the difference between a hard, you know, a 99 mile an hour ground ball and a 100 mile an hour ball off the bat that carries all the way to the wall in the air. I think it's really how you come through the zone because a lot of guys, you know, come under the ball and above the ball off the tee. You're not going to get good readings. You got to go straight behind it. That's why a lot of strong kids have weaker exit velos. So it's really just how you hit it more than how hard you're hitting it. Just let him know if he gets 100. That's what we're working for. That's what we're working for right here. Come on, make some noise for him. <laughs> you got it. Jeez. You got it. Woo! That's good. That's good. Man.